welcome back to my channel. My name is Julie and we are getting ready to go to Hawaii for one month. And so today we're finalizing packing and then we're headed to Charleston because I'm flying out of Charleston. The flight was like way cheaper, better flight. So that is what we're doing. So let's go. First things first, I already made my coffee. Also put on another layer of tan. Er, I use Coco and Eve right now, but I've been hearing about Bondi. Bondi Boost? No, Bondi Boost is definitely not it. Bondi Sands? Bondi something? I haven't tried it yet, but for now I use the Coco and Eve. I'm not taking it with me on the trip, so anyways, we are sticky and got the light, uh, the light robe on. This was a really cute robe that my friend got me for being in her wedding. It has my name on it somewhere. Oh, it has my initial, J. Anyways. So I do not want to come home to a, a dirty house. And so first things first is we're going to clean up. Uh, pause for a moment, moment, pause for a moment. For the Grande Cosmetics sent me a PR package and it's the cutest thing ever. Like, I feel like I should take it with me to Hawaii because time change is gonna be, so I may, I may need this. Um, and then my fave, Lash Serum Mascara. Comes in a little bag, what? Oh, and then we got travel size and a cute bag. Look, it even says Grande Getaway. They knew I was going to Hawaii. All right, let's go back. Okay, so like I said, I'm going for a whole month. So this is the only bag I'm taking. I'll get into the bag later and how I'm not super thrilled about it, but it is what it is. So I use packing cubes. I have two sets. I have this set that's like more of like a quilted. And um, normally these are the ones I had, but I needed a second. We needed more because we're going for a month. So. Everything is in packing cubes that I'm taking. I had to readjust my packing probably four times. <laughs> and like, I'm really struggling because like, do I bring the clean white tennis shoes? Like, will I even wear those in a way? The steamer is like a must have. I'm like, that's like a, we, we can't, I have to take that. One other thing I'm struggling with if I should take is the hair dryer with my diffuser. I'm really struggling with that. If I take out the shoes, and I could have the dryer. Do I want the shoes or the dryer? I don't know. Also, I have to take into effect that I may go shopping. I really don't need to. But like, I honestly can say I really feel like I need all this stuff. And then these are a few things that I feel like I want also to put in, so. And then like, I only have one. And then those are my comfy Nikes. And then I have one pair of sandals underneath here. But like, I wanted to take the black ones. I wanted to take these. I can't. I don't have room. Another struggle is like bathroom stuff. Like I still have to fit a lot of this in there. This is very unfortunate because I lost the cap to this and it's like big, but it's like, it's one of my favorite misses. Let's do a little skincare. I want to treat my skin really good. I shaved my face last night. So I gotta get it looking right. Um, this company sent me literally a whole box of stuff. I was like, oh my gosh, I do care. Is that the name of, or Zen Kitten? I don't know. Either way. Thank you. Oh, this smells like rosemary. I'm really sad I'm, I'm not taking all this on my trip. This is my snail mucin. It's really good for hydration, so I need my face to be super hydrated, especially before be in Hawaii and also, um, like I said, since I shaved my face. Do of the Gods Under Eye Volumizing Collagen Pads. I got these in my Etsy bag and I haven't tried them yet. I packed a few for my Hawaii trip, so let's put them on. Ooh, I like these. Put it up too high. Ooh, I like them because they stick like, you know how you have those um, eye patches that, those eye patches that are like slimy and like fall off your face. Those drive me crazy. I have a whole list of things that I need to do before I leave. And one of them is to leave my mail keys for my friend who's gonna come and check on my house and also take care of all my plant babies. So that is done. I like to unplug things when I leave. So we're gonna unplug the TV. I'm gonna leave the internet because Taylor's gonna come over and I want her to be able to have Wi-Fi in case she needs like to chill for a minute. Also gonna unplug this and my Apple TV. Also, I have a Fina box. Keys are in my car. 
And so I'm gonna leave the PO box piece in case there's anything that urgent that comes that Taylor can check for me. Also, I want to take the trash out, final trash bag out. So I'm not coming home to a stinky house. and I'm not gonna ask my friend to, to do all that. So that'll be fun. Okay, so we're gonna pack my favorite lipsticks. So this one is a brand new one. I haven't even tried it yet. It's Fenty and they're red, y'all. <gasps> I cannot wait to wear that in Hawaii. So we're definitely taking that because that's brand new. Okay, so I really love this um, L'Oreal. It stays on forever. Uh, this is just like a real her, it's like a soft pink. And this is Gerard Cosmetics, and this is a Hydromat. I really love this. It's like a, a dark nude. Um, I really love this element. I don't even know how to say it. This, I love this one. Oh, we need my nude um, lip liner by NYX. Okay, I think we have enough. Okay, it's decision time. Do we bring the white tennis shoes or not? These jeans are like still wet. I was like, if I could choose between one out of these four shirts, which one would I choose? And I said all of them. Look how freaking cute this is, this cover up. I ordered $275 worth stuff. Everything except for two things worked. And really one of the things it worked, I just didn't love, love it. And the other one was like, I could probably make it work, but the pants were a little too small. Okay, so I had this outfit laid out. My sister got me this. Uh, the brand is Imperfect Mommers. I'm not a mom, but it's still really cute. Hi, I'm here to check into my hotel and work out. Anyways, it comes with like pants. I got the shorts, the sports bra, and this top. So I feel like this is very Hawaiian. That is not Hawaiian. This is salsa. It's not even salsa. I don't know what it is. Okay, we're moving right along. Doesn't look like it. But we are. All right, we're still letting the tanner sit. I think it's almost ready. Let's make a protein shake while we finalize some things. So, um, but things are moving right along. It is 11.35. I had plans to leave here by 12. That's probably not gonna happen, but that's okay. Like. I just didn't want to leave here at like nighttime and be like super stressed and stuff. So we're doing pretty good. I just finished my video for uh, my friend that's going to water my plants. There, I have a few plants that are just finicky and like, oh, what is that bug? Ugh, whatever. Um, so that is checked off my list. Can y'all see me through the plants? So I'll be gone a month. So I'm going to do some laundry by myself. And then I'm also going to use like a drop off laundry service. But I'm gonna take these strips with me because I could wash like my underwear and like some things in a sink or a bathtub because they literally, I think I've talked about this in a previous YouTube, I'm obsessed with these things. So basically they're strips, but this is the laundry detergent. So I could literally put this in the sink and wash my underwear and stuff. Also, it's got like a perforated um, line, so I could tear this and only use half of it. So I'm gonna um, take these with me. My link is in the description. I have a discount code. So if you wanna try them, highly recommend. I'm making sure all my bills are paid before I leave. And then I'll have my friend check my mailbox to make sure I didn't miss any bills. Um, Cause we cannot be past due while I am gone. But yeah, doing that. And then we're about to hop in the shower. We, me. You're not gonna come with me. We don't have that kind of relationship. All right, last bill is paid. Woo! One thing I just thought about is I'm gonna miss my electric toothbrush. Am I gonna get cavities while I'm gone? Okay, this is what I decided to wear just on my road trip to Charleston. This is from Amazon, I'll put the link in the description. It's super comfy. I wanna take it to Hawaii with me too, so it's just perfect. So then I can wear it today to Charleston and then I'll just put it in my bag. Somehow we'll have to get this bag down. It's very heavy and I know, I already know, I'm gonna have to pay fees for it being oversized. Oh dear, I'm so scared I'm gonna break one, one of the wheels because 
I'm gonna slide it down because this is what happened to me before my Miami trip. It was too heavy and I broke the wheel and imagine me going <laughs> through the airport running with a broken wheel and a really heavy bag. This is so heavy. Maybe I'll go through it tonight and see if there's anything I can take out. <laughs> I feel like I really need one of those hard shell ones right now, but I paid $60 for this in Miami and I refuse to throw it away or buy another one until I get at least like four uses out of it. Help me. Ow! Just laid it on my toe. I am Hulk. Oh, I'm not. Huh. Why am I making so many weird noises? I don't know. Come on, Julie, think more. I think it's super important to be um, hydrated like before a trip too. So, especially like with traveling. Wait, what did I do with those? Oh, I forgot I bought on Amazon. Oh, you're falling. Oh, they're like this homeopathic like jet lag medicine. What is happening? I'm gonna try that and I'll let y'all know how it is. The jet lag, um, the jet lag medicine, but these liquid IVs are like literally lifesavers. So like one pack of these is like worth like four bottles of water. And I'm already like kind of dehydrated because I don't remember drinking a lot of water yesterday and I definitely haven't drank any water, a lot of water today. So these are a travel necessity. I really hate leaving my room like this, but oh well. Just doing one more walk, final walkthrough to see if everything's off. Normally like you would cut your water off in this case, but since I have someone come in to water my flowers and my plants, um, I can't cut my water off. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really gonna miss my monitor and my keyboard. If I ever become like a true digital nomad where I, which I'm 80% sure I'm going to do that for like one year, like travel the world um, and not have like a house, <laughs> then I will need a travel, those like travel monitors and like travel like keyboards because I would have to have it. Like there's no way I could go a year without like a keyboard and a monitor. I would, I would get nuts. All right, bye house, bye plants, stay alive, please. See you in a while. Okay, we're almost to Charleston, but I'm freaking out because I already smell, like I smell my rosemary oil and I'm like, please don't let something already be busted or spilling in my suitcase. So we'll check it when we get to the hotel. Woo! After evaluating, I only came up with four things that I'm willing to give up, and they're not even that heavy. My slippers, which I really want to bring. Extra sunscreen, which that's not even heavy. This, it's not even, I mean, it's somewhat heavy. Well, everything counts, right? You know, like this eye cream. I just found another eye cream in there, so I can do without one. Shaving cream, I hardly ever use shaving cream anyway. My steamer is what I really want to take, but I mean, it is, it does take up space, and it's like, like, anyway, so I'm gonna go through, comb through it one more time, and then I may just accept that I just, I'm just gonna have to deal with the heavy bag, I think. We'll deal with the packing thing a little later. And get some work done. Oh, this place is so cute, but they're like known for all their grits and yummies, but I was really basic and got a salad because I'm about to be in a bathing suit for 90% of the time, so, you know. <laughs> the girls at the front desk were like, seriously, you didn't get the grits? I'm like, no, y'all, I'm going to Hawaii. I'll eat bad when I'm in Hawaii. Somehow, I'm still feeling like I'm packing. If I counted how many hours that I packed for this trip, over 10 hours. <laughs> anyway, so what I have decided to not bring is the steamer. I think what I showed you earlier, also a pair of jeans that I really want to take and then the same stuff I showed you earlier. So I don't even know if it makes a difference. Oh, and then also I'm gonna put my ashwagandha, this like glass bottle into like um, the pills into like a little baggie. I have a little baggie somewhere, but I'm just a little frustrated because I feel like I'm gonna be gone a month and I'm just not gonna have enough. But what I'm gonna do when I get there, I am going to literally just take a mental note of everything I actually wore. And when I get back, I'm gonna make a video of everything that I wore versus how much I have left over. And then I feel like that'll make me feel better because I feel like I won't wear everything, but then I probably will wear everything. 
on another note, how cute is my little outfit that I'm gonna change into? I'm either gonna change into this um, when I get to Honolulu and then just like right when I get off the plane or I'm gonna change into this outfit uh, when I get to Dallas and wear this on my eight hour flight. I haven't decided but most likely I'm gonna wanna wear my leggings for the long flight. And then I'll just put that on uh, literally like when I get to Hawaii. So still deciding, but that's gonna go in my little um, boat bag. I hope y'all have enjoyed my day before vlog. This is brow serum at FYI, not like we're going to bed and we're not getting ready. <laughs> Anywho, excited about seeing y'all tomorrow in Hawaii. So follow along, subscribe, hit the bell button to get notified of all my new uploads. I'll be doing weekly vlogs for Hawaii, but I also will be doing um, some one-off vlogs. So like there's one day where I tour the whole Oahu Island. So that'll be a whole vlog in itself. And then all my adventures and stuff will be like their own little vlog. And so you don't want to miss those. Thanks for spending the day with me. I had so much fun. I can't wait for y'all to join me in Hawaii. See you soon.